Alright, so for dinner today, it is the day before school. Starts again from winter vacation. So we have something super easy. We have breakfast for dinner. I have cilantro on my counter. Um, so Lena is having scrambled eggs, breakfast sausage. My kids are obsessed with breakfast sausage. So yes, they both have ton. Um, a little bit of an avocado that we had left over and then some mandarin oranges. Arrows is not like avocado, so she gets an extra egg and there's a burnt end from it. An extra egg um, and then mandarin oranges and sausage. And they are both going to have some juice. Let me show you the juice they're having tonight. It is the white crayon strawberry. Alright, so she doesn't. The one's yours. Tonight for dinner, we are having homemade potato soup. So I'm using some leftover ham that I had in the freezer from Christmas. And I have some celery and carrots and a bunch of stuff in there, seasonings. And I'm topping mine with pepper and shredded cheddar. And then we have some rolls. These are just like the sister rolls, sister sherbet, I think, whatever it's called. I just put it in a pan and baked them in the oven and just topped them with a little bit of butter. So I thought I would show you guys today breakfast. We are having today, well actually Francisco is having today. I ate some potatoes over here with um, some salsa I made and some Nepalis which are like cactus and then I popped it with some queso fresco and then we have two eggs cooking over here. She doesn't like the yolk runny. So I just break it. So I have two eggs frying on the side. And then again, like the potatoes with the cactus and the cheese. And then I just made the salsa. It's just this um, homemade salsa I made. So that is what he's having today. So tonight for dinner, <clears throat> we have over here some apricot chicken that I made in the pressure cooker. It's French dressing, onion soup mix, and um, apricot preserves. And they put it in the pressure cooker again in their chicken legs. And then I'm making some of this um, ranch cauliflower in the microwave. And then over here, I have sauteing some mushrooms and zucchini and some olive oil with salt, pepper, and garlic. And then for <clears throat> hubby, he won't eat that. So for Francisco, I'm making some of this yellow rice. But I have to go to work. It's super late. I have to be at work at 8 o'clock. Um, I work at home and it's 7.32. So... <clears throat> I'm making him the rice in the pressure cooker according to the directions on the back. And what I'm going to throw in there is some chicken legs. I actually have cooking in there now, just salt and pepper. <clears throat> so once the chicken legs are done, I'll put the rice in with the chicken legs so I'll cook a little bit more because they're still a little frozen. And then in here I have mushrooms that I just like quartered and a uh, poblano that I just chunked up pretty big. So this is going to go in there <clears throat> with the rice and the chicken legs for him. So for dinner tonight, I went big major grocery shopping because we actually have a nice day here for once. So I went super easy because I, if you can tell, I'm in the middle of so much stuff. So Lena has ABC chicken nuggets and then ketchup and then we have one of these car car oranges and an apple. The girls are just splitting one orange and one apple. And then Ariel is having grilled cheese and yes, she does eat two grilled cheese because she does it. She starts like right there where she eats so she doesn't like anywhere near the crust all right so for dinner we have my garlic rice just basically white rice but yeah, i season yeah, it with this caldo and um i put fresh garlic in it okay, and then we have some roasted broccoli it's just some spray oil this salt and pepper and then we have our chicken this is that greek chicken again the ice all right so for dinner tonight we have salisbury steak this is, I recorded a little bit how I made it, um, just a really simple for a steak recipe, some green beans, um, and other veggies that I got, and then some homemade mashed potatoes. I only made a little bit of mashed potatoes, so, I don't want any leftovers, um, for tomorrow. So, this is my plate, so I just have the green beans, one of the Salisbury steak, and I poured tons of gravy over, and my kids are fighting. Alright, so here's what's for dinner tonight, guys. We are having a sriracha brown sugar pork loin. I this at Kroger and just threw it in. I actually got two of them because they're super small. And I want leftovers. 
and then I roasted just some potatoes that I scrubbed them, sorry I'm eating a mushroom, <laughs> scrubbed them really good with a little bit of olive oil, salt, pepper, and garlic. And then back here we just have some zucchini and mushrooms that I just cooked up as well. I don't know why it's not focusing. There we go. And I just cooked those in some of my favorite coconut oil, which I am almost out of. It is just this one. It is the butter flavor, and it's really good.